Hey there all craft cider lovers, time for another cider review. So yeah, back at it again guys with a uh, cider. Newcomer on the channel, we have we are going for the first time around to Emma Buda Bryggeri, Emma Buda Brewery, uh, out of the county of Småland down south in Sweden. Uh, we're taking a look tonight at their Emma Cider. There you go. Very nice looking, playful, uh, cartoonish, graffiti inspired label. Very nice. Uh, plain yellow bottle cap there. Uh, not much information, however. It says ingredients 100% Swedish apples and sulfites. This one clocks in at 6.6% ABV. And that's it. 330ml bottle, of course. Uh, so, yeah. Let's pop it, see what we're going to get then. There we go, good deal of smoke, like a chimney of smoke there. And the cider is going out. Oh, very carbonated. Very, very carbonated. There we go. Gotta stop right there. Okay, so, as you can see, heavy carbonation, but it's quickly dissipating. Uh, oh, I can get that cider smell already, so gonna pour in a little bit more there we go yeah I'm gonna stop right there so guys there are a couple of drops left in that bottle what do we have of course as you can see golden honey golden color massive carbonation on that uh, cider looks nice there you go let's get the aroma Oh, it smells very pleasant, I have to say. Yeah, kind of a strong, funky apple aroma on the nose. Ugh. Yeah, definitely, you do notice a little bit of that alcohol as well. 6.6%, so it's a little bit of a stronger cider. Yeah, but I mean, funky apples, a little bit of that funky barnyard character. Strong apple aroma, bit of alcohol, but it, it smells very, very nice. So with that said, let's dive in and see what we're going to get. Cheers, everybody. Oh, this is, oh, okay. So, yeah, it's a... Uh, it's a very kind of a sharp taste to it, uh, and at the same time, uh, it, I'm gonna pour the rest of that cider in. There we go. At the same time, it is a little bit watery, to be honest. It's a little bit watery in its character, but at the same time, we got a sharpness to it. Can be that carbonation and a long acidic aftertaste. Very acidic, actually. Uh, very sour at the back end. Let's go for another sip. Yeah, so acidic, citric, yellow apples, a uh, bit of a funkiness, but also a little bit watered down in its taste. Very acidic aftertaste to it. So I mean, if you like your, I would say it's not it's not sweet uh, sweet at all. Actually, it's very acidic, very very citric in its character but if you like those ciders that type of cider this one will definitely i guess uh, up your alley um uh, yeah so i mean emma buda bryggeri it's a beer brewery but uh, as many other beer breweries they're they they have kind of dipped their toes into the craft cider waters with this one more and more breweries seem to do that they kind of uh, engage in a little bit of cider making so i mean that's interesting of course but perhaps they don't have that knowledge of make cider making that pure and simple cider companies have so but i don't know uh, i'm not bashing emma buddha uh, at all uh, but uh, final sip yeah so uh, very very sharp, uh, acidic, sour, long acidic aftertaste, yellow, uh, sour, acidic apples in there, 
bit of a funky note as well, but also a little bit of a watered down character. Uh, I would have preferred a little bit more sweetness in the cider, to be honest. Uh, yeah, and a little bit less on that acidic uh, flavor, but it is what it is. Not a bad cider, but uh, I mean, the smell was a little bit better than the taste, if, if I'm honest. I'm going to give it a three out of five. And it, I mean, it's interesting to have tried it out, but won't be buying this one any more times. So, 3 out of 5, that was everything I had for today. Thumb me up if you like the review. Thank you for watching.